Welcome back to our channel and thanks for joining us. If you're joining us for the first time, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. In our last video, we headed south to New Hampshire and Dory gave wakeboarding a try on Lake Winnipesaukee. We spent some great time with family and also had a chance to take a look at a used RV. In this video, we're back and forth between Quebec and New Hampshire and we get our truck ready for our new tiny home on wheels. papers. Ok, parfait. Oui, c'est gentil, merci. Bonne journée. zone so that was a quick trip to New Hampshire we actually went there to see that fiberglass uh, fifth wheel escape love it. it was our favorite but that was uh, one of the main reasons we went there and of course to go see my godson but you know luckily everything was nearby so we're super stoked for the new fifth wheel hopefully everything works we went to get a quote to uh, install the fifth wheel on our truck, the, I don't know how do you call that, uh, the, the hitch, pretty expensive, anywhere between 1,000 to 1,500. Wasn't expecting that, but it is what it is. I'm happy we're gonna get more space. Now we're back to this place, got tons to do, got a lot of work, gotta cut the lawn again. And we got to fill up the container. So we move the container out of here. So the casita will come over here because she needs a nice wash and we got to fix her up. We got to fix every little thing that needs to be fixed before we put her up for sale. And the uh, escape will be in the campgrounds. So hopefully within the next two weeks, everything is done, right? And this was so unexpected. 
uh, honestly and that's what I like about the camping life today is something you never know what's gonna happen tomorrow so, so we're starting to become little Dr. Doolittles because we see all these critters we're saving frogs anytime we see one and we discovered a little bunny's nest oh my god it's so cute and we check on them every day and they just get so big so fast and the last time we checked on them yesterday they they were so little their eyes were closed and now they're even bigger and they have a little bit more fur so I'm gonna show you So we just check on them every day, but we know Mama's coming back every day to see them. And they're just so darn cute. And uh, they're hungry, but we're gonna let them get back in and hide. Uh, they have little ears now. I think I saw three last time, but we're gonna cover them up because this has gotta be a little stressful for them. We just wanted to show you guys. So we're gonna cover them back up and let them wait for their mama. Oh my god, they're so cute. Oh. Hey, good morning guys. Today, Friday, July 26th. Big weekend coming up. Today, I'm at Roulette Lupien. We have an appointment for eight o'clock to get the uh, fifth wheel hitch on her. He's up. Apparently it takes almost three hours to do that. Yeah, I'm anxious to see what it looks like because I mean I've seen a fifth wheel itch before, just not on my truck. Missing one part for the uh, itch. And that part, uh, I mean Charlie has it. Charlie is the guy we're buying the escape from. So he's selling us the, the hitch that goes on top with the four pins and I just needed to install this. All right, so it's 12.38. I'm about ready to leave. Going to Magog. It's about an hour from here. And this is because Man is in Montreal and she's driving to Magog to meet me there. So we're gonna leave a car there and then we're gonna go to the US. So I'm half an hour away from Magog. So Mena's gonna drive from Montreal to Magog because she was closer to the border than me. And if she would drive back up to Drummondville to come so we would leave together, she would have ended up commuting about an hour and a half longer. So she told me to come and meet her up at Magog. And we're just gonna find parking to leave the car there for a few nights and then pick up the car on Monday. The car is a, it's a second hand car we purchased. We don't use it. Uh, we actually gave the car to Nana's mom. And when we're in town, we use it because it's cheaper on fuel than the, than the truck. I did a little detour because I really wanted to drone in this area. I've been seeing aerial pictures about this area and it's really nice. And I've been dying to come here. It's only about an hour and a half from Drummondville, but it's pretty close to the border every time we, we cross. And every time we're doing a border crossing, we're always in a rush. So today, everything worked out perfect, at least to show up over here and drone this area.
then we're done. Now, I think we're half an hour away from Magog. And I gotta go find a parking space for Mana. Thanks for the dust. And we're in the US. <laughs> Again. It's like what, second time this month? Yeah. Second time this month. Ah, quick trips. Second time in three weeks. Welcome to Bernie Hello. Sanders. Bernie Sanders? Is he Vermont? I don't know. I thought Bernie Sanders is Vermont.